Does that refer to Muhammad? Does that uh, sound like Muhammad? Does that refer to Muhammad? Does that uh, sound like Muhammad? So you have the two criteria of being like Moses, knowing God face to face. In other words, having such a high relationship with God and miraculous works performed in the sight of the people. Sam, do, yeah. do those, do, does that refer to Muhammad? Does that uh, sound like Muhammad? Definitely not. No, no, definitely not. No, no. Does that refer to Muhammad? Does that uh, sound like Muhammad? listening of like Moses in the context of the book of Deuteronomy why because Deuteronomy itself defines what the phrase like Moses is referring to in this context we turn to uh, Deuteronomy 34 and this is what we read this is what like Moses means since that time no prophet has risen in Israel like Moses This prophet, like Moses, was to be raised up from the countrymen, the brethren of the Israelites. No one would have said this refers to Arabs. No. no one would have said this refers to Arabs. No Jew, no Jew hearing this verse would have said, aha, when it says from among from among our brethren here, it must mean from among some Arab tribe, and it must mean thousands of years after this prophecy. Uh, this is not how they would have interpreted it. They would have said, yes, we're waiting eventually, but it's going to be right here in Israel. But it's going to be right here in Israel. Mash commentary, a well-respected Jewish Orthodox commentary mentions on page 187, the sages note the sto uh, Torah statement here that in Israel there would never be a prophet like Moses implies that among the non-Jewish nations there could be such a prophet implies that among the non-Jewish nations there could be such a prophet Would have said this refers to Arabs. No, no one would have said this refers to Arabs. No Jew, no Jew. Jews and Christians in the seventh century who are waiting for the prophet. But I will mention one person by the name of Abdullah bin Salam. May Allah be pleased with him. Which he says, when I heard about the apostle, I knew by his descriptions, name, and the time at which he appeared, that he was the one we were waiting for. And when asked by his aunt about this prophet, um, is he the one we've been waiting for, he replies, um, I said, he is the brother of Moses and follows his religion, being sent with the same mission. I said, he is the brother of Moses and follows his religion, being sent with the same mission. He also says, I recognized him as soon as I seen him. You have the two criteria of being like Moses, knowing God face to face. In other words, having such a high relationship with God. Knowing God face to face, in other words, having such a high relationship with God, having such a high relationship with God. Now, one of the titles of Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, in Islamic sources is Habibullah, which means beloved of Allah. So I hope he's listening. So you have the two criteria of being like Moses.
and miraculous works performed in the sight of the people. I want to spend a little bit of time talking about some of the authenticated miracles of the Prophet Muhammad. I mean, of course, the greatest miracle that was given to the Prophet Muhammad was the Quran. But there are many authenticated miracles, and it is not often known and mentioned, that were done through the Prophet Muhammad by the power of God. So I hope he's listening. So you have the two criteria of being like Moses. Does that refer to Muhammad? Does that uh, sound like Muhammad? Yes! 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 